All right, everybody, and we're back for episode five of uh, Claire Young. And last time, I guess we were looking around, trying to check out some cars, see if there's any good options there. Um, <clears throat> I'm to give it some thought, and I think what I need to find is a pool. A pool would be nice. Power armor there, okay. Stuffs. All right, but you know what, in the meanwhile, what we're going to do is we're just going to read a bit more because getting some of these skills up will be very good. Um, so we're going to do, yeah, we're going to do clothing. Tailoring is a good skill. You can fix up your clothes. You can make new clothes. You can... Ah! What on earth? Stop it. Yes. It's been wildly in mess. Hit the cougar. And the cougar's dead. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, that was that was fun, wasn't it? Hmm. I'm just gonna go ahead and drop the rotten meat. Uh So the littering begins. I am thirsty though, so we'll drink. And I'm hungry as well, so we'll keep drinking. You know what, I'm going to eat the oatmeal before that goes bad. Alright, not too bad. <clears throat> I just, I didn't even know what was happening. I just saw all the messages over on the right side of the screen. And it just, it freaked me out real bad. Um, Alright, so as you can see, you know, now that I've raised my skill, um, I don't know if I pointed that out earlier, but I didn't really have that many recipes before. Now I have quite a few. Um... Yeah, there should be a few new ones in here. Uh, do, 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 yeah. 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 Alright, but we're going to keep reading. Because <clears throat> I want to get this up as high as I can. Um, so that there's less chance of completely... De uh, yeah, we're going to stop. What's dangerously close? A firefighter zombie. A decaying human body clad in tired firefighting gear. It staggers aimlessly, reeking of smoke and decay. Ew. Um, yeah, come on. Hey, Mr. Zombie. I hit him, I hit him, and he's dead. Utility vest? Yes, please. Um, yeah, I think that's all I want. And yeah, we're going to put that on. And we're going to have our torso completely <laughs> encumbered now. Um, I might be able to do something about that. Soon. What is my tailoring skill? My tailoring skill is currently 2. Uh, shredded is the last step before, I believe it's the last step before... Aha! Okay, I was able to successfully repair the camo tank top. Good. I don't have enough rags. Okay, well that's okay. Um, let's try... Okay, I don't have enough rags for that either. Do you have anything that was cloth? Cotton, rather. Brawn panties. It was a lady firefighter, apparently. Or a cross-dressing firefighter, but we're not going to go there. I'm going to take the camisole, I'm going to take the jeans, and we're going to use our knife on the camisole. Now we're going to use the knife on the jeans. Oh wow, that's a lot of rags. Okay, cool. Now let's see if I can fix the trench coat. I don't repair it. Uh, let's try it again. Ah, I damaged it further. Shoot. Um, okay, I'm not going to try that again. Let's just... There we go. Extra sturdy on that. Uh-huh. Yeah, I want to... I want to see if I can make anything else extra sturdy. Ah, okay. Hunting cap. <laughs> I have an extra sturdy hunting cap. I need leather to do the quiver. Um... Try the army pants. And the fingerless gloves. I don't have enough leather for that. Yeah, the sunglasses I can't do anything with. Utility vest. Okay, I was able to repair the utility vest. This is good. Oh my goodness, perfect. Yeah, I don't really care about the thread. It's easy enough to get more of. And it's extra sturdy. And I guess... Um, probably... Yeah, I guess uh, 
when something's extra sturdy like that and it hasn't been made to fit, that means you can't make it fit. It does have zero encumberment anyway. What's the protection on that? Storage is 14. Covers the torso. Uh, if I make the tattered trench coat fit, I won't be too bad, but that, um, that minus three melee and minus three dodge is really bad. That means like I will never dodge ever. Um, hmm. All right, let's just keep on reading. Maybe at level three, we'll try it again. And if I completely destroy my, uh, <sighs> my trench coat, then it's just going to be unfortunate. I'm going to ignore that brushing sound that I heard from the east. Um, I'm guessing that's just wildlife of some sort. I'm hoping. I'm going to keep on ignoring that. Monster dangerous is close. Yes, I will stop. It's a grabber zombie. So I guess he was making all that racket. Doesn't matter. He's down now anyway. Well, it gives a chance to stop and eat. You know what? There should be a bush out here. There's a bush. The bushes are still here. I forgot about this church. Um, okay, where's that zombie? There it is. He's going to come for me soon. <clears throat> In fact, it looks like he's coming for me now. I'm going to just drop that trench coat right now. <laughs> uh, that'll make me overly encumbered. Let's get rid of the frying pan. Let's get rid of the hacksaw. Hammer. I need to figure out what the most encumbering item is in my inventory. And just drop that each time. Okay. Block with the katana. It hit my torso. From the southwest, there's glass break. Oh, there's another zombie. That's decided to chase after me. Alright. One whack on the zombear. Another whack on the zombear. My utility vest is ripped. And... That's it. He's dead. We're good. Hey there, Mr. Zombie. I know you're coming for me. I guess you were looking for me. Do -do 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 right, so um, one thing that happens that's really, really aggravating, but it does make... <sighs> no, yes. Uh, sorry, it's really annoying, but it does make sense. Um, I lost my train of thought. Never mind. Forget what I was going to say. It happens. I'm getting old, I guess. All right. We want to make food. Let's make meat. Uh, yeah, we'll stop. What got dangerously close? Damn cougar. That's right. Run away. Come here, bitch. <laughs> oh my gosh, this stupid thing! But the thing is, it'll it'll always stay relatively close. So and it'll always stay hostile. So trust me, that thing's gonna come back for me. Uh, hello zombie, you're dead. Yeah, but true anyway. No, I don't really care about any of that. Okay, thank you. I finished the one chunk of meat. Killed zombie. It's got a leather belt. I'm gonna take the belt. And chocolate drink. I'm gonna take the chocolate drink. And a cellular telephone. Yeah, I'm taking that too. Alright, let's see. Oh, right. Food. Food. Ugh, oh, no, ignore the wolf. I don't care about the wolf. Now the wolf is close, I care about the wolf. One, two. Wow. One hit. <laughs> Takes me forever to hit it, but one hit, and that was it. Finally killed the wolf. All right. Now, make plenty of... Okay, we're good on the meat. I have no water left. <clears throat> Not going to worry about it. Uh, now, I'm going to eat my meat. That's right. Drink my chocolate drink. Now, if I bring this up, you can see I enjoyed a chocolate drink. I enjoyed a hot meal. So, my character is very happy. Now... Finish reading. There we go. All right. So now my tailoring is three. Skill level won't improve, but it does have more recipes, which I think we've actually looked over before. We did. 
But you see now I can make all the recipes that it has grayed out there. So I can make cargo pants, I can make fingerless gloves, I can make leather gloves, I can make fur gloves, I can make sundress. I cannot make hot pants. Leather hot pants for hot pants or regular hot pants at this point. But I'm not terribly concerned about that. Um, I am, however, going to try to... Okay, sports bra is now extra sturdy. And the boxer shorts are now extra sturdy. And my socks fit. And are extra sturdy. And I don't have any leather, so that's not happening. Uh, let's see. The utility vest. Really? I, I can't. Do I not have any rags left? I have a rag left. I could have sworn it let me do things. Ah, all right. <clears throat> well, that's the end of the trench coat. Unfortunately, that's okay. I'll pick up another one. <laughs> Alright, let's just try that again. I know I don't have that item. It's because it's the wrong item. Okay, this time I'm able to properly repair it. And properly repair it and prove the fit. And... Make it extra sturdy. Okay, fantastic. Alright, this is good. Uh, all right, so you can see the ones that are bright green, I guess you could say, are the items I was not able to reinforce yet. Um, there's a way around that, which is I could. Ooh, oh, that's from the bush. Um, I might burn the church down. I don't know if that's going to be a thing that's going to happen here or not. Um, we'll we'll worry about it later, <laughs> or not at all. Do 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 back in the house. Watch, I'm gonna call it a night soon, and just wake up surrounded by uh, fire. It's a thing. It'll happen. <laughs> Hopefully, it won't happen, but it, it'll probably happen. Three pieces of leather. All right, so we're going to fix up my fingerless gloves, and we're gonna make them extra sturdy. And I wonder if I could quiver. No. No. Ah, okay, I was able to make it extra sturdy that time. Probably the steel-toed boots. Yep. And let's try that utility vest again. I don't have enough rags. Oh, oh you know what? I was going to wear I was going to wear this just for fun. There we go. All right, and now you see um so I have an encumbrance of 1 from the backpack. I have an additional encumbrance of one because I'm wearing too many, too much clothing, basically. But a minus two, I can handle minus two, especially with a um, <sighs> especially with a katana. Yeah, I I can't express that. I just I can't explain that well enough. The katana is just it's overpowered, really, and I love it. So now we're going to learn a little bit about first aid. Sorry, day nine. This is this is good. This is good. I'm doing well. Um, I did learn how to make a saline solution. Failed to learn a recipe. I'm going to read even though my character is tired, because why not? More about first aid. Learn disinfectant. That's good. And increase first aid to level two. All right. Let's eat some meat. Drink some water. And, uh, hmm. Yeah, so I'm not going to learn any more recipes. I'll show you all that soon. Um, yeah, I'm not going to learn any more recipes, though. I can bring my first aid to skill to three. I think I'm at two now. Yeah, I'm at two. Let's make that three. You know, three is a... Get as much out of it as we can. Um, it'll be good for using bandages and first aid kits and just general shit like that. So, <clears throat> yes, I know I'm swearing a little bit. I'm sorry. All right. Oh no, I don't want to save and quit. I want to sleep. Let the character sleep for a while. Ah! I woke up with a zombie. Stab. Stab. It's dead. Hey, hey, that's it. <laughs> um, let's try going back to sleep. Okay, I was able to fall asleep again. That's good. I was a little bit worried because I think I got. 
Uh, what perk did I get? No, I didn't. Okay. Usually I go for, um, like, Insomniac or something like that. And when you do that, you usually have a very difficult time having your character sleep if they've been woken by a giant <laughs> a zombie grabbing them. Uh, I didn't mean to eat that. I wanted to drink that. All right, there we go. <clears throat> Still can't see to read. Uh, because there's a thunderstorm outside. Um, weather, the, the fact that weather plays is usually pretty minor. But, um... Er? What's all this up here? These are doors. Pile of ash. Apparently the pile of ash tile is, uh... It's a wooden door. <laughs> I'm not gonna knock it. The game's come a long way. I know, um... The graphics are non-existent at this point, but it's actually, it's a lot better than what it used to be. Because there used to be no graphics. It used to just be nothing, <laughs> for lack of a better word. It used to just be um, no tiles at all, just, just randomness, randomness everywhere. Okay, so this is a grocery store. What do we got here? Peppermint patties, butter co buttered popcorn... A samurai novel. Ooh, you know what? I might be able to get a little bit out of this book. Yeah. What else we got? Beans, dusk mask, black pepper. It's really not going to be too much in here that I'm concerned about at this point because I don't want to. I don't want to fill my inventory. I take that back. I don't want to fill my inventory too much. Uh, actually, you know what we're going to do is we're going to take the. I've got a lot of bottles of water at this point. <clears throat> Excuse me. Go drop that. Drop that. I'm gonna drop the cell phone. I don't want it. And what I meant to do is I have here. Hmm, have here this gallon of water. Gallon of bleach. I'm sorry. We're gonna unload that onto the ground because I'm not concerned with it. And no, I'm not going to pour ammonia on top of it. That'd be silly. Oh, you can also see my morale right now is very low. I did not like the dry oatmeal. And I myself am wet. Hence, uh, the focus gain is minus 0.16 per minute. You know what we're going to do is we're going to actually... The reason I wanted to do that is there's a gas station. The gas station's all the way up there. I don't know if I want to mess with that right now. You know what we're going to do? We're going to go over to this house... There's another zombie necromancer. Okay, but right now nobody sees me. Everything's cool. Trapping skill, survival skill, marksmanship, rifles. Don't need that one. Survival skill to two. Archery for kids. Um, hey there. We're just gonna do 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 do. Just gonna hop in here. What do we got? Let's read. Yeah, I guess I can't worry about that. This seems... You know, even though I have a high enough survival skill, I want to see what recipes they've gotten here. Heavy wooden arrow shaft, small game arrow, heavy fletch field point arrow, poppy sleep, poppy painkillers, fungicide, antifungal drug, antiparasitic drug, and fur sleeping bag. Meh, why not? So, um... <clears throat> to discuss the recipes again, sometimes you come across a book and, uh, you know, it'll have recipes in it, but you won't be able to learn any skill. Um, I'm going to wait until it gets close. We're good. So I can't get any skill from it because I'm already at proper skill. However, I can go through and learn various recipes from this book. That shocker zombie, just he doesn't even know what's going on. What's up here? Tons of things. What's in here? Hello, uh, we have metal crossbow bolt, Ruger 1022. What's this? Steel toed boots and a tool belt. Alright. Well, forget my leather belt. I'm gonna wear my tool belt. From the northeast, I heard a clang. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, it's it's all those things out there. Those things out there are not happy. Um, so you can see there's an acidic drizzle coming down. And if I look over at the wolves... Uh, actually, everything's fine. Alright, we're just going to close that door. 
close that door. I'm just going to chill out in here and read in peace. Um, unfortunately, I really can't leave now. Um, now that we have a nice acidic drizzle, drizzle going on. Um, an acidic rain. An acidic rain. Uh, I can't really stand out in that too long. But now you'll see... Oh, that's odd. I would have thought for sure that... There we go. Okay, so these two wolves are now injured. Thanks to... Um, I guess, I wonder if this guy spawned or something. But yeah, they're injured because of the acid rain that's coming down. I, too, would become slowly injured if I stood out there too long. Uh, yeah, so what'll happen is you can just sit, chill out, and uh, you can learn a bunch of recipes from books that you cannot learn more... Um, you can't raise your level with them, but you can learn more recipes from them. It's very useful. Um, sometimes they will require skills from you, you have to have a certain level of skill before you can learn the recipes and occasionally you'll find ones that have a crossover <clears throat> excuse me so um uh, here we go so the book has more recipes but you don't have the skill to learn them yet so if i bring that up uh so the pocket survival guide so i can't make heavy wooden shaft which arrow shaft small game arrow heavy fletched field point antifungal drug antiparasitic drug i can't make those right now and the reason is probably because I don't have enough cooking skill for the drugs, and um, I probably don't have a high enough fabrication skill for the arrows. That's my guess, anyway, because right now my fabrication is zero. <laughs> so, yeah. That's why that's the case. Uh, so, ugh, it's an acidic drizzle out here. I'm not pleased. Not pleased. Gotta go back in here. <clears throat> you know, there's a lovely little house right next to us. We're just gonna go ignore the zombie necromancer. Just gonna hop over the fence. A lot of times people leave their back back doors open. No? There we go. Yeah, a lot of times people leave their Yeah, of course there's too many items in the way. Ugh, all the things. Ugh. People usually leave their back doors open. I don't think the pathing is currently set for zombies to hide inside houses. I may be wrong on that one. No, I'm, I'm not wrong on that one, because all the doors were closed and everything, so they couldn't have gotten in here without going through the window, which is why the window was broken as they tried to escape to uh, come at me. Alright. Sorry about the confusion there. And, uh, let's... Right, because my other flashlight burned out. We'll flick that on. What do we got? A lawn dart. <laughs> Actually, it's not bad, except for the zero damage part. And U.S. Weekly, yeah. Nope, not going to happen. Turn the flashlight off again so I don't just drain the battery out for no reason. Self-esteem for dummies, no. Uh, cornmeal, I don't know what I can do with cornmeal. Let's find out. Oh, wrong button. Uh, food, drinks, meat, veggies, it's probably... Cornbread. Three cornmeal and a fire, and I can make cornbread, which has a very low nutrition. <laughs> um, is there anything else I actually want cornbread for? Oh, cornmeal. Uh, I could use Tyler to make Johnny Cakes, which is a fried bread treat. Mm, no. 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 Okay, yeah, I'm going to leave that then. <clears throat> I mean, I... Ooh, that's new. Sorry. I just noticed here, I can actually make cornmeal with corn. And a kiln. <laughs> um, right, so you might remember from before in chems, I couldn't make anything. Now I can make salt, water, lamp oil, poppy sleep, poppy painkillers, fungicide, super glue, which might be useful, um, and plant food, which might be useful. So, uh, yeah, that's cool. New recipes for me to make. I know I'm thirsty. Drink clean water. Uh, what have we got in here? <clears throat> Soap, bleach, water, oxygen tank, plastic cough syrup. Let's just carry on down this way. What do we got up front? I see a tough zombie outside, which I'm going to ignore. Not too much else going on in this house. Uh, let's take a look at the map. What's new down here? Fast food, gas station and a bar. 
Um, let's make a run for the... Ugh. You know what, let me check my clothes out first before I get running out there. How do my clothes look? Clothes are good. Alright, we're doing it. Making a run for the gas station. Uh, what's this up here? Fat zombie corpse. I'm gonna butcher you, yes. Um, what's up here? A zombie corpse. So, as I mentioned before, you can actually see, like, so there's zombie corpses out here because the acidic rain basically took them out for me, so I didn't have to worry about it. Alright, running for the gas station. Oh my gosh, there's zombies everywhere. Where's the spitter zombie? I need, I need to take him out immediately. No, I'm not going to step into the acid. <laughs> I'm not that crazy. It does not, however, <clears throat> kill all of them. Uh, what else we got? Tough zombie. Okay, tough zombie down. Butcher him. Butcher him. Nothing useful. Nothing useful. Butcher him. Nothing useful. Okay, so acid ring stings, but it's mostly harmless now. However, you will see... No. I thought there was a debuff for that, but I guess not. There's a hardware store. That might be worth checking out. Alright, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. <clears throat> um, it's almost always a horrible idea to run across town like this. I never recommend it to anyone ever. <laughs> but, you know, I've got a giant. Okay. So the boomer, which is right here, spewed bile. Apparently I can't see anything now. Except for what's right next to me. I'm going to ignore all the distractions because I want to butcher that guy. I see nothing. Oh, hello. Alright, so you hear that that clanging? That clanging is actually a zombie trying to attack me by going through the car. Ignore all of those. No, don't stop butchering. What's next to me here? This is another garage. I might have some luck in there. A garage, a gas station. <gasps> A library. All right. Fantastic. I'm glad I came out this way. Let's explode that boomer. Just head right down the street. Everything else can see me. I can't see anything else. Come on. I really want to get there. There's zombies everywhere. They're destroying cars to get to... Oh no. <laughs> I'm like getting surrounded. It's cool. I don't care none. It's fine. Kersplat. Kersplat. Alright, I see you there. No, don't step in the acid streak. Yes, step in the acid streak. And get on out. Kill him again. There's another one down this way. No, stop it. He's down. He's down. Can't see anything. He's down. Okay, from the southwest I'm hearing a crash. Alright, we're just going to wait here for like, just just five minutes. Ignoring all sounds. Okay. Okay, I see, I see them. They're all coming at me through, I think, an ambulance? Hippie van. <laughs> take out the shocker zombie, take him out, take... Oh man, this soldier zombie is... Ah, alright. Everything's dead. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and start butcher any anyway. Butcher this one. What's on the ground? Just because there's a CBM here. Oh, I, I couldn't get them out properly. Alright, so real quick, we need to make sure we do some zombie cleanup. Oh, hello. You look like you're <laughs> stuck in the car. Alright, so I think... think that's everything? Yeah. That's all of the zombies. All of the zombies that I've previously killed, that <laughs> ambushed me, are now dead. Quite a battle, I'd say. 
And uh, I'm moderately hurt. What's my head say? My head says I have a bite, a very painful bite. I'm going to use the first aid kit on the painful bite. And I was able to clean the wound. Um, it's really critical. Uh, if you get a bite, like a, just from a random zombie, it won't really cause any issue. But, sorry. Ignore. No. I just want to make sure that the corpse is done. Um, sorry, yeah, you, you get bit by zombies all the time, but occasionally um, they will turn into, like, bad bites or something of that nature. So you want to make sure that if you get a bad bite, you want to make sure you take care of it, otherwise um, you know, that'll kill you. So I guess a regular bite won't kill you, but you can get a dangerous bite or an infected bite, and that will kill you. And things are looking okay here. I mean, I could get some heroin if I wanted to shoot up a little bit. I'm just going to sneak in here. This should be the office, right? No? Bathroom? Okay. I mean, I guess. And here we are. We're in a closed room. We're in the gas station. Directly across the street, there's a garage. We've got a hardware store, a library for me to check out. Houses galore. Another garage. We are definitely going to be able to get a car. I think. Definitely gonna be able to get a car. And, uh, yeah, so that's awesome, and, yes, and we have 113 kills, oh my gosh! Um, so as I mentioned before, the katana, pretty overpowered, I mean, you know, I am, like, half injured, a couple more bites to my head, uh, you know, a few zombies that want to take out my face, and I would die, so it's not like I'm completely invincible, but 113 kills, it's pretty damn amazing. Pretty damn amazing. But just wait, like a zombie brute will come crashing through the wall, and you don't want to mess with those, just ever. <laughs> anyway, uh, if you enjoyed this video, as always, please like or subscribe, or better yet, both. And um, we'll see you next time on Cataclysm DDA. <laughs> Alright, take it easy.